I'm from Guatemala and as soon as I arrived to Germany and I wanted to open my bank account here, I realized very quickly that not all the banks in Germany wanted me as a customer. When it comes to opening your bank account in Germany as a newcomer, your nationality plus your resident status play a big role. In this video, we talk about how to navigate this topic in Germany and also reveal a tool that we have created for you to make this process a lot more smoothly. smoothly. So first, let's ask the big question, when does nationality matter? Nationality matters most when trying to open a bank account when that is with an online bank. As an example, the German online bank DKB, which is a very big and trustworthy option, is notoriously known for not accepting non-Germans. And other online banks only accept certain nationalities and it's not always the same nationalities. There are various factors for this, which we don't know all of them, but one big crucial one is the identification of a person when opening a bank account in Germany. So whenever you open a bank account in Germany, you need to identify yourself, and that is in the shape of presenting either your passport or your ID or residence permit. And depending on your nationality, this is the first tripwire, let's say, when not all banks accept everything. We did our research, and according to an online bank's help form, we found the following explanation. Some nationalities may lack the necessary security features on their government-issued documents that allow for online verification of an individual's identity. We are not responsible nor decide on the required country of residence nor the list of, of acceptable documents. This is determined by digital banking regulations. And a lot of online banks don't allow you to verify yourself in person. That is why this is such an important factor. So in these cases, your verification happens in an app through your phone, through a video call. However, not all banks accept the same nationalities also through the video call, which makes it really confusing and hard to understand. As an example, N26, the biggest German online bank for internationals, does not accept Colombians, whereas Tomorrow Bank, another online bank in Germany, does. So what gives? And why are we making such a big deal about the online banks? And that's because at least at the time of recording, 2023, Online banks are the ones that usually have the most amount of services in English. That includes a website, application, customer service, contracts even, even though the German one might be the binding one, they still translate it for you. So that is why it's super attractive to think, oh, I'm gonna just open it with this online bank. But hold and behold, not everyone accepts all nationalities and we have made it very clear in the past, I think, minutes. On top of nationalities, some banks also require your residence permit, which you will usually only get after a few months living in Germany, and others don't. All in all, this is so intransparent and random that it's really hard for you to understand which bank will accept me and which won't. As an example, Mexicans that arrive to Germany, they can immediately open a bank account with N26 or Tomorrow Bank without needing the residence permit, which usually happens in the, through a visit through the Ausländer Behörde, which is the immigration office, versus in comparison Indians. To open the bank account with N26, they need to have the residence permit. So two different uh, requirements for two different nationalities for the same bank. To shed some light on this mess and to help you navigate the German banking market more smoothly, smoothly. we have created Banky. If you find the content of this video helpful, then make sure to hit that like button. And if you would like to keep up to date with content that will help you settle into life in Germany more smoothly, smoothly, then make sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you'd like to go the extra mile and would like to support this channel even more, you can do so at simplegermany.com slash coffee by buying us a virtual coffee. Thank you for your support. Now, what is Banky? Banky is a dynamic form that you fill out and based on your nationality and residence permit, we match you with the potential banks that might accept you as a customer. This allows you to save time by not going into each bank's terms and conditions or even worse, spending time and applying for a bank for them at the end just to reject you. You can find Banky at simplegermany.com slash Banky. Or in the description below. As a disclaimer, the banks that bank you will suggest to you are just possible options. It is not a guarantee that these banks will accept you as a customer, as there are also other factors that play a role. What these factors are, we don't 100% know. Every bank has their own procedures on fraud and security measures that play a role in the decision. Also very important is that Banky only shows a selection of a few banks that are available in Germany, which we selected based on the fact that they offer all or most of their services in English, which we think you should have access to. It is not a complete market overview of all of the banks that exist in Germany. Again, you can find Banky at simplegermany.com slash Banky or in the link in the description box below. We hope this tool is helpful to you so you can successfully open your first bank account in Germany. Until next time, cheers! cheers. Whee! 
and reveal to you a tool we have developed to make this super steep, simple. Smooth. Simple. Super. To make it smoothly. Yeah. yeah. As other players. <laughs> players. players. <laughs> <laughs>